right, folks, this is Grandison Shines, the marketing director for MEOR, and today I have with me the CEO and inventor of the patented TSTM process of what we're going to talk about today for treatment of your oil wells. No matter how large your oil field is, we can treat your oil fields with a specialized treatment that's never been on the market before. So again, thank you very much for agreeing to make this video with me. What I want to do is talk to them about why and how your process, one, is much better than the hot oiling that they probably do right now and the chemicals and or steaming? Well, that's a good question. Uh, in, in the market today, typically uh, hot oiling is probably the, the number one way in which they uh, reduce the paraffin from the well. And what they do is they'll take oil that's already been pumped out of the well, right. spend all that money to pump the oil out of the well, and they'll, they'll put it in a, in a truck, a holding truck, heat it up to a certain temperature, and then pump it back down in the hole. And they pump it back down in the hole in hopes of melting the paraffin that's built up on the side so they can keep production in that well. Uh, typically, they'll lose 10 to 20% of that uh, oil that they pump that back down in the hole. And when they say lose it, they typically mean that they, it hasn't come back within the next few days. Right, okay. So, uh, with that, they also have a problem with damaging the skin of the soil, the skin, is one of the big problems. And, and another problem they have is when they melt the, the wax, it only melts to a certain point. And then what we have a problem with is we've left a layer of paraffin buildup. It gets tighter and tighter and, and a stronger and stronger matrix okay. over time. So now the production starts again and all we do is start building up the paraffin on that, on that already produced paraffin layer. So it's so much easier uh, for the paraffin to build up. The unique, and so that's on the, the, on, the, uh, on the hot oiling side. The other side is chemical. We use benzene, toluene, xylene, all these cancer causing oh, agents. Chemicals. They're terrible. Yeah. And, and they use these down holes. They work uh, a lot of times. You gotta use copious amounts of them, but they are tough to handle. Right. And then they have a potential for polluting water streams all around. And mm -hmm. a lot of it's on ranches. And, and so you're using pr pretty nasty stuff. And you've got personnel injuries that you gotta be That's concerned true. about. And then the, the last one is steaming, like in California or, or some of the states that are, are very environmentally friendly, they use steaming, where they put very hot water or steam down the hole to melt the wax. And they only get limited results with that. Uh, the right. paraffin, again, is still laying there in a tight matrix, builds up real quick, not the most effective way to do right. it. Okay. So correct me if I'm wrong here, they're using, on the high oiling process, they're using paraffinated oil to treat paraffin. That is exactly correct. Paraffinated oil to melt. Melt paraffin that's built up on the sides of the uh, walls of the well. So how does that work for them usually? Typically, uh, they, it's, a, it's a, month a, month, a once a month or once every two month process. They have to go back and do it again and okay. again and again and again. And it's okay. turned into quite an industry with hot oilers as they uh, constantly uh, are putting uh, the owner's oil back down in the hole. Really? Okay, so how does the TSTM process differentiate from hot oiling and all the other treatments? Well, what I saw when we, when we were called out in the field to help solve this problem seven years ago was this problem. And, and so we came up with a unique solution where we actually use a product called Sludge Slammer, which is a, 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 it's a, a white oil based product that uh, with many other products in it, it's a, it's a unique product that's environmentally friendly that when in, put in the hole, it liquefies the paraffin. Okay. And, and, and it, it doesn't melt it, it liquefies, it turns it back into its flowable form, and it, it, it does it all the way down to the mild steel matrix. So nice. with paraffin buildup, you have something called under deposit corrosion, you start eating holes in your piping, and sooner or later you'll end up having a, a leak from the, the hole that's been developed from under deposit corrosion due to dissimilar oxygen levels. With our process, it takes it all the way down to the mild steel with the sludge slammer. Then we use two other products, which one is called salt extractor. Now salt extractor is a combination of humic fulvic acid. It actually is an organic, environmentally friendly keelant that chelates the calcium and the magnesium salts back into solution. Okay. Okay, so right. when we chelate them back into solution, the soils that the oil flows through are all negatively charged. And over time, when the water flows through them, calcium magnesium builds up, it starts to close up the soil. What the, the salt extractor does, it chelates or pulls these salts back into solution and opens up the pores of the soil again so we can have good gas and oil flow uh, 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 that was never there since the inception of the well opened up. Then we have, um, the last thing is a bacteria treatment that uh, goes down the hole and the bacteria, its function and purpose is to take heavy oils 
uh, and paraffinated oils and asphaltenic oils and eat them and, and um, its byproduct is a lower hydrocarbon chain oil. So right. it makes everything uh, flow smoother. These three products are added in one application okay. called the total system treatment method, down hole, recirculated for 24 hours, and the well is opened back up. In 73% of the time, there's the marked, in marked increase in oil well production. Wow. So typically, the process pays for itself in what it costs, it pays for itself and then some from the increased oil that's been produced. So basically you're taking paraffin, you're turning it in, back into oil that's flowable that they can barrel and sell that's and correct. make more money. That's correct. Nice. That's nice. Correct. So that's the basic process, that's the basic system, and um, we're really excited about uh, We've done research and development now for seven years out in the field. We know it works. We've done it in just about every country in the world, China, Brazil, uh, United States, Canada, and, uh, and, and we've been every, when we're getting ready to start some in, in, in Uzbekistan, Kazakhstan, and Russia. Nice. So um, it, it's a unique uh, answer to an age-old problem. Uh, the big problem we've typically had in the industry is it's in something new, so with something new, it takes a little bit of time for it to, to catch on in the market. Right. Good. So we're excited. Good. For those of you who want to know more, make sure you go to paraffin2oil.com. Excuse me, paraffin2oilnow.com. And that's the number two. So paraffin, the number two, oilnow.com. And we have a special offer for those of you who are watching this video. So go there now. We'd love to, to service your oil wells in the field. Thank you very much for listening. And we will be talking to you soon. Bye.